Hello Universe Explorers, have you ever wondered what happens when a star reaches the end of its life? And what if I told you that the death of a star is one of the most fascinating and essential events for the creation of life in the cosmos? Today, we will explore the phenomenon of supernovas, these stellar explosions that not only light up the universe but also create the fundamental elements for our existence. Curious to learn more? Then, let's begin this cosmic journey. First, we need to understand what a supernova is. Simply put, a supernova is an extremely powerful explosion that occurs at the end of a star's life cycle. There are several types of supernovas, each occurring in unique ways and involving different physical processes. We will explore these types in detail in the following chapters. Core collapse supernovas happen to stars that are at least eight times the mass of our sun. When these stars exhaust their nuclear fuel, they can no longer sustain the radiation pressure against gravity. The core collapses, causing a colossal explosion. This event releases an enormous amount of energy, and can outshine an entire galaxy for a short period. During the collapse, the outer layers of the star are expelled into space at incredible speeds. The collapsed core can become a neutron star or, if the mass is sufficient, a black hole. Core collapse supernovas are responsible for creating many heavy elements like iron, which are essential for the formation of planets and life. Thermonuclear supernovas occur differently. They involve white dwarfs in binary systems. A white dwarf is what remains of a star like our sun after it has exhausted its fuel. If a white dwarf is in a binary system, it can accumulate matter from its companion star. When the white dwarf's mass reaches a critical limit, the pressure and temperature increase to the point of triggering an uncontrolled thermonuclear explosion, completely destroying the star. These explosions are also incredibly bright and release vast amounts of heavy elements such as iron and nickel into the interstellar space. These supernovas help enrich the interstellar medium with essential elements for the formation of new stars and planets. Another fascinating type of supernova is the partial collapse supernova. These explosions occur when massive stars undergo instabilities during their final stages of evolution. In these supernovas, only part of the star collapses, while the rest is ejected in a violent explosion. These events are less energetic than core collapse supernovas, but still release a significant amount of energy and matter into space. Partial collapse supernovas are less common and less understood, but they are important for studying stellar evolution and galaxy dynamics. They also contribute to the synthesis of heavy elements, although on a smaller scale than core collapse supernovas. Pair instability supernovas are rare phenomena that occur in extremely massive stars, with at least 100 times the mass of our Sun. In these stars, the production of pairs of particles and antiparticles in the core can cause a loss of pressure, leading to a partial collapse followed by a gigantic explosion. These explosions are so powerful that they can completely destroy the star, leaving no remnant behind. These supernovas are rare, but extremely bright, and can be observed at great distances in the universe. They are responsible for producing heavy elements in significant quantities and play an important role in the chemistry of the primordial universe. Another intriguing type of supernova occurs when two stars collide. This phenomenon can happen in binary star systems where the stars are in extremely close orbits. The collision causes a massive release of energy resulting in a spectacular explosion. Colliding stars supernovas are rare but provide valuable insights into stellar dynamics and the formation of binary star systems. During the collision, enormous amounts of stellar material are ejected into space, contributing to the formation of new stars and planetary systems. These events are important for understanding the formation and evolution of galaxies. A lesser-known type of supernova is the type Iax supernova. These supernovas are similar to thermonuclear supernovas but occur with much less energy release. They involve white dwarfs in binary systems, but the explosion does not completely destroy the white dwarf. Instead, part of the star survives and can continue accumulating matter from its companion. Type Iax supernovas are less bright than other supernovas, but they are still important for understanding the diversity of explosive stellar phenomena. They also provide clues about the processes that can lead to different types of stellar explosions. 
Type 2 supernovas are subdivided into types 2L and 2P, depending on the light curve they present. Type 2L supernovas show a linear decline in luminosity after the explosion, while Type 2P supernovas have a plateau in the light curve, where the luminosity remains constant for a period before declining. These types of supernovas occur in massive stars that retain their outer hydrogen layers until the explosion. The difference in the light curve is attributed to the structure and composition of the star's outer layers. These events help understand the final evolution of massive stars and the distribution of heavy elements in the universe. Supernovas play a crucial role in the cosmos. They are responsible for the synthesis and dispersion of many heavy elements that make up planets, stars, and even ourselves. Elements like iron, gold, and uranium are forged in the extreme heat of these stellar explosions. Without supernovas, many of the elements essential for life as we know it would not exist. Therefore, in a very real sense, we are all made of stardust. Astronomers observe supernovas using powerful telescopes, both on the ground and in space. These events help us understand the evolution of stars and the dynamics of galaxies. Additionally, observing distant supernovas can provide clues about the expansion of the universe and the nature of dark energy. For example, the Hubble Space Telescope has captured images of many supernovas that have helped modern astronomy measure the acceleration of the universe's expansion, one of the greatest discoveries of the 20th century. The observation of supernovas is not a modern phenomenon. Historical records show that ancient civilizations, such as the Chinese and Arabs, documented supernovas visible to the naked eye. The famous supernova of 1054, which created the Crab Nebula, was observed by Chinese astronomers and remained visible in the daytime sky for weeks. These historical records are valuable to modern astronomers because they provide information about the frequency and nature of supernovas over the centuries. They also help connect the evolution of stars with historical events on Earth. The future of supernova research is promising. New telescopes and technologies are being developed to observe these events with greater precision and detail. The James Webb Space Telescope, for example, will allow astronomers to study supernovas in distant galaxies with unprecedented clarity. Additionally, international collaboration in projects like the Vera C. Rubin Observatory will help detect supernovas in real time, providing new opportunities to study these spectacular phenomena. Supernovas have a significant impact on cosmology. They are used as standard candles to measure distances in the universe due to the predictable brightness of type IES supernovas. These measurements help discover the acceleration of the universe's expansion, which led to the hypothesis of dark energy. Dark energy remains one of the greatest mysteries of modern cosmology. Studying supernovas allows scientists to refine their models of the universe and explore the nature of this mysterious force that influences cosmic expansion. In addition to creating essential elements, supernovas can also have a direct impact on life on Earth. Nearby supernova explosions can affect Earth's atmosphere, increasing mutation rates and potentially influencing biological evolution. Some scientists speculate that mass extinction events in the past may have been triggered by nearby supernovas. These impacts show how supernovas are deeply connected to life on Earth, not only providing the building blocks of matter, but also influencing the very evolution of life. And there you have it, folks. Supernovas are not only incredible spectacles, but also fundamental to the existence of elements and life in the universe. The next time you look at the night sky, remember that every star could one day turn into a supernova, contributing to the eternal cycle of cosmic birth and rebirth. Did you enjoy this dive into the universe? Then give it a like, subscribe to the channel, and turn on notifications so you don't miss our next cosmic explorations. Stay curious because the next video will take you even further into the universe. Until next time, Cosmos Explorers.